Over the past few weeks, we have heard from Central Bank of the Midwest about the power of kindness. This morning, we continue to celebrate kindness and continue that series, which highlights people making our community a better place to live. This week's recipient of $500 from Central Bank is Tim Goins from Independence. Tim's story is a classic tale of a good neighbor. Let's take you to his neighborhood where this story begins. Just care for my neighbors. They're, some are working extra, some work early, some work late. Um, so if there's an opportunity I can do something, I'll, I'll do it. Last winter when it was so freezing cold and he promised he would shovel my snow and he works during the day and he gets home late but it was like nine or 10 o'clock at night and he still came up here in that freezing cold weather and shoveled my snow. I was so impressed with that. Dana has uh, leg issues at the present time and I've asked if you know, she needs her trash taken out for Sunday That's night for good. Monday morning pickup so she ain't gotta try to get out with her bad leg. Uh, winter time, um, our street is half the time plowed, half the time it's mostly ice. Uh, not much of a hill, but uh, if I can, I got a four wheeler with snowplow, so hell, I'm, I'm playing. Knock it out. And Miss Hillary here with us is going to show you what we've got for you. So, on behalf of Central Bank of the Midwest and KCTV5, we'd like to present you $500 for your random kindness. So. Tim, we're really excited for you. We, we can't thank you enough for <laughs> what you're you. doing for the community. Thank you, guys. <laughs> thank you. You're welcome. Thank you, dear. <laughs> uh oh, I think I'm getting a hug. <laughs> Thank you for all you do. Anytime. Don't you cry. <laughs> <laughs> I haven't seen anybody as dedicated to serving other people as Tim. And of course, his wife was sick for a long time, and he still kept up his service to the neighbors. I lost my wife in March. So. They brought over food, asked if there's anything to need. Uh, Ray, take me fishing anytime. Just, just say the word. Let's go. We have a really nice neighborhood, and it's really calm and quiet, and there's no drama. And I just think that uh, he contributes to more than that. He contributes to a nice atmosphere. Other than a gentle wave, if somebody goes down the street or say good morning to somebody who's walking their dog instead of just kind of shying away from them. So, I think that's just interaction with anybody that's in the neighborhood. It's kindness just stopping to talk. And he obviously has been serving up that kindness for at least six months since we had this colder season. So congratulations to Tim. Do you know someone who is showing kindness in your community? If so, you can still nominate them through July 30th. Visit our contest page at kcv5.com. Click on the Celebrate Kindness tab. And don't forget to share your stories of kindness on social media. Use the hashtag CelebrateKindnessKC.